Do you ever get frustrated because you're doing all the right things, but it's just taken too long to get the results that you want? Hey, welcome back. Jeff Hagee, Daily Success Strategies. Thanks for being with me today. It can be so frustrating to do the right things day in, day out, and it just seems to be taking forever to get the results that you want. Things just aren't turning out how you hoped they would be. It's not coming as fast as you wanted, and you're just thinking, is this worth it? Has that ever happened to you? Well, first of all, look at your th things that you're doing. Are you doing the right things? Are you taking the right actions? Do you have the right strategies in place? Are you giving yourself an adequate time frame to accomplish these things? Do you know how bamboo grows? So when you plant bamboo, you've got to nourish it. You've got to water it every single day. You do that for the whole first year and you don't see any results. Nothing happens. So you come back the second year, you do the same thing. You water it, nourish it, do everything you need to. Nothing happens. You don't see anything. You do this for four years. Nothing happens after four years that you can see. Then one day in the fifth year, you get up one morning, there's a little sprout. The next day, it's grown more. And in no time at all, all of a sudden, it's 90 feet in the air. Well, during those four, first four years, it wasn't just waiting. It wasn't nothing happening. Underground, the root system, everything was establishing itself. Everything was building so it had the strength and support to support that 90 feet above the ground. So there's often times that we want results so bad that we want them so quick, but we're doing the right things, but not giving ourselves the right time frame to accomplish things by. So make sure if you've got the right plans, if you're doing the right things, make sure you're looking at the right time frame. Make sure you're giving yourself a chance. Now, I had a conversation this week with someone about something similar here. We talk a lot about success leaves clues. What are other people doing that you can say, okay, I don't need to recreate the wheel. I need to do similar things. And this person was saying, okay, that's what I've been doing. I've learned what the best in our industry are doing. And I've been trying to mirror it as best as possible but I'm not getting the results that I want. Well, you're taking the actions, but are you doing the exact things that you need to be doing? Look at these people, watch what they're doing, listen to what they're doing, how are they doing it? They've figured something out, learn from them, understand exactly how they're doing it. And again, I've talked about this before. What people do often is if they're at a level one, they're looking at someone at a level 10, and they want to close that gap. They want to be at that level 10. So they start taking the action and they expect they take the right actions. They're going to be at level 10 right away. Well, that person that's at level 10 didn't go from one to 10. They figured things out on how to get from one to two, then two to three, three to four, all the way up till 10. So you got to figure that out too. How am I going to get from where I am now to the next level, to the next level until I can get to that level 10? but it's going to require work. It's going to require a plan, dedication, and in a lot of instances, patience. Now, are there ways to speed things up? Of course, every situation has different opportunities, but the reality is whether it's making money, whether it's success and whatever you're looking at doing, they all have their own recipes. If you follow the recipe, you're going to be able to figure things out. So hopefully these are, th these are things you can look at what you're doing, how you're doing things. This will give you an opportunity to really analyze those things and understand what you need to do to push forward. Now, talking about recipes, one of the things we're doing right now is we are starting another group coaching program, teaching people the recipes they need to, to be successful as people, to be successful as entrepreneurs, to be able to take whatever they're focused on to another level. 
I'd love you to check it out with us. jeffhagey.com slash group coaching. We've got some rooms for some more people to join us. So check that out. And otherwise, I will be back tomorrow. Hey, athletes and parents of athletes. So much time, money, and effort is put into the physical aspect of your sport to become the best you can be. But the mental game, it's often neglected and it's just as important as the physical game. In fact, it's usually the differentiator between the good and the great athletes. Come and join me in the Confident Athlete Program where you'll learn to control your confidence, develop a powerful mindset, and unlock your full potential. Go to jeffhagey.com slash confidentathlete to find out more. I look forward to seeing you there. Hey, some of you may know this, but in addition to my coaching, I've recently joined Geneva Financial Home Loans, a mortgage lender headquartered in Chandler, Arizona as a mortgage loan originator. I've always had a passion for serving others, and now I'm proud to also be a part of Home Loans Powered by Humans. If you're in the state of Arizona and looking to take the next step in your journey, contact me at 801-830-3858 to start the conversation. NMLS number 42056, BK number 0910215, Equal Opportunity Lender.